Well, I'm a uh, uh, commercial uh, lawyer with a specialty in real estate, and the practice has really evolved um, organically since I was called. Um, I started out doing mostly real estate and then actually was able to broaden my practice over the years um, to a point now where I get uh, quite a variety of commercial matters, um, which I find really enjoyable. It's nice to have a uh, change of pace and uh, to be able to do a number of things uh, on, the, on a day-to-day -day basis. I think one of the things that my, our clients appreciate about me the most is that I'm a solution-focused lawyer. Um, I like practical answers. I like uh, helping people solve their problems um, without uh, getting too far down into the, uh, the finer points of legalese. I think most of my clients are business people and they appreciate somebody who can uh, see the world the way they do from a business perspective. Uh, teamwork in our context is probably one of the most enjoyable aspects of my job. Um, it's great to be at a firm like DLA Piper that has uh, people and offices all over the world and the opportunity to put teams together um, with true subject matter experts uh, where everybody's really working collaboratively. Um, some of the best uh, experiences I've had as a lawyer have come from uh, working with teams uh, and, and my colleagues um, who are all uh, you know, at the highest levels of their profession. Um, and for me, uh, the, the best case scenario is uh, where everybody is collaborating together and, and sharing uh, the file in a way that uh, makes it really enjoyable. Uh, takes the pressure off of any individual person and, uh, and helps sort of really leverage the experience and the expertise of, of the group. Well, I do, I do find the practice law to be meaningful. Um, I think it's, uh, it's something you have to work towards doing and finding uh, the rewarding aspects at time. Um, it's, it's, you know, it's, it's not always uh, on a day-to-day -day basis easy to remember that the job we do uh, has real value and, and, and we're helping people solve uh, their real problems. I think, um, you know, my pro bono work has helped me remember uh, the, the real value that we can add as lawyers, but uh, on, on a day-to-day -day basis, I think it is really rewarding. I, I take a tremendous amount of pride in being able to help somebody start a new business or uh, help them sell a business that they've spent their life building and move on to the next phase of their lives. That's a, that's a very rewarding uh, experience to be a part of and, and to help be, you know, um, help facilitate. I, uh, I volunteer with uh, Access Pro Bono BC. Uh, they have a, a series of, of pro bono clinics that they host. I, I do one a month uh, and have since uh, since 2009. Um, it's a, I always refer to it as the, the only real test I get of my legal skills because um, you have a half an hour session with clients and they're coming to you with um, usually fairly complicated problems uh, across multiple <laughs> legal disciplines and, uh, and you have a short period of time to try to help them. Uh, you know, the other thing that really it brings home is that as lawyers, you know, we have a skill set that uh, is incredibly valuable in helping people solve their problems in our community. And uh, I think sometimes, uh, particularly commercial lawyers, um, you know, we can get caught up in, in our larger commercial transactions and our, our more sophisticated clients and forget that we have an ability to really uh, help the people in our community generally. And, and give back in a meaningful way. And uh, being able to assist people who uh, otherwise would not have access to legal counsel, um, to give them hopefully a solution to their problem or at least um, reassure them that uh, there is a solution to their problem uh, is probably one of the most valuable and meaningful things that I've been able to do as a lawyer. I think the challenges facing the legal profession today are, are obviously uh, very uh, numerous, but um, you know, I think we just have to remember that our role in, is, as a professional is, is one of a trusted advisor. And um, you know, I've tried my best with, with my clients that I've cultivated to play that role. And um, I think the, the changes in the legal marketplace, the changes in the way that legal services are being provided, will, there will always be a need for, uh, for people to play that trusted advisor role and, uh, and a true counsel. 
Um, and, and so I think uh, keeping some perspective on what we are trying to be as a profession helps navigate some of those challenges.